You're watching CNA Heroes. Here's Lisa Sweet. Welcome to CNA Heroes. I'm Lisa Sweet, co-founder of the National Association of Healthcare Assistants. If you're watching this video and you know a CNA hero, please send the information to me through the email shown on the screen. I would love to feature your CNA hero. Today's CNA Hero was initially published in Mega Doctor News, a bilingual newspaper. So many CNAs working in healthcare have come about their career somewhat by happenstance, taking a CNA class in high school, and everything just rolled into place for them. Others have had to work really hard for it. It was quite a challenge to get their certification, and this is one of those stories. Nadia Rodriguez from Brownsville, Texas, now 28 years old, traveled an incredible journey to get where she is today. Reading her story makes me realize how easy so many of us have had it and how much I take for granted. This is her story. In 2002, Nadia's father was deported to Mexico, so her family followed him, leaving Nadia without a high school to attend. In Mexico, she was reunited with family who were doctors, and the plan was for her to do that too, but it didn't work out the way she had hoped. With violence in Mexico increasing rapidly during that time, the Donna, Texas native returned to the United States at 18 years old and as a freshman in high school. Nadia states, I was behind in my studies. I completed my freshman and sophomore year at the same time, and I was going to do the same with my junior and senior year, but I got married and started a family. However, Nadia felt like something was missing, and that something was a high school diploma and a college education. With her children now eight, seven, six, and three years old, she felt it was time to finish what she started for herself and for her children. So Nadia enrolled at Brownsville Independent School District Adult Education Program to work towards her GED. Initially, she was only working to get her GED, but when they told her about a CNA program at Texas Southmost College, TSC, she knew this was her opportunity for a career. Nadia said she shed many tears throughout her journey to completing both her GED and the CNA program. Nadia explained, juggling school, a family, a business, and taking care of my father in Mexico who was recently diagnosed with heart problems was a lot to handle, she continued but my husband and my kids are what kept me going. They were so excited to see me pursue something I loved and to see me finish. I couldn't let them down. But the day finally came for Nadia, who was one of nine graduates honored last month during a pinning ceremony hosted by the Texas Southmost College Certified Nursing Assistant Program. I cannot believe it finally happened. I'm making my dreams come true, Nadia explained. It feels so surreal yet liberating because there's no stopping me now. When asked about what she has learned about herself along the way, Nadia replied, if this experience has taught me anything, it's that I can do whatever I set my mind to. I have proved to myself that I am capable and I can persevere through tiredness, stress, or whatever else comes my way. She added that every day she is thankful for the opportunities that BISD and TSC presented to her because they were life 
changing. Nod just says, one dream down, many more to go. I am proud of myself and I am going to keep pushing myself until I become the registered nurse I aspire to be. The growth and the opportunities I have seen so far are only the beginning. What an incredible story of a young woman juggling so many responsibilities to reach her goals. I have no doubt that Nadia will be an extraordinary CNA and someday a nurse as she has already demonstrated perseverance, hard work, and dedication. Nadia, thank you for taking that difficult journey. I am sure there would have been many times that quitting would have seemed like the easy way out, but you persisted. And we here at the National Association of Healthcare Assistants are glad you did, as there are so many needing your help. Congratulations, Nadia Rodriguez. You are a CNA hero.